Here's Pre-Calc Lesson 101, number 16. It starts out with log base 4 um, of 4th root of x. And then this one got, has got the um, square root over the whole thing. At first I made a mistake and wanted to just write this as a half on the x, but then I realized I need parentheses. So I put parentheses around this, wrote it as the half power. Uh, fourth root of something can be written as um, a power of one-fourth. But And then if you write this one like this, you can bring the one-fourth out front using that log law that, about the exponents. Um, then I want to get rid of this half, so I square both sides. So squaring the left-hand side gives me 1 16th, and then this whole thing is squared, and then this thing. And then I was like, oh, there's no getting, there's how, how are we ever going to get out of this? Then I realized, well, if I think of this whole big clump as like x squared, and there's an x, I can use factoring and the zero product property on it. So I'm thinking of this as like 1 16th x squared, thinking of this as just x. So I brought this over to the other side, set it equal to 0. Uh, use the, well I'm going to factor out a log base 4 of x, and then uh, use the zero product property. So set each factor equal to 0. Well when I set the this um, log base 4 of x equal to 0, I can use the expo, or I can use, uh, put it in an exponential form. So 4 to the 0 equals x. Well, 4 to the 0 is 1, so x is 1. Over here, 4 to, oh, I'd have to multiply both sides by 16 to get that to go away. That's where the 16 came from. And then 4 to the 16th is x. And I, I looked in your answer book, and they don't bother putting this you know, this would be so have so many digits in it, you just want to just leave it like that. And that's all.